How many dinosaur eggs do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Did you notice that one of the packages are different? Yeah, this one's different, and I'll show you why. Here we have some Matchbox Dinosaur Eggs. These are not current products. This one's called the Dino Eggs Pack, and this one's called the Creature Cars Pack. As you can tell, these are different. The dinosaurs are a solid color, whereas all the dinosaurs in the other packs were green. The Creature Cars packs are copyright 2005, and the Dino Eggs pack was the next year, 2006. Both packages use the same vehicle coming crashing out of the egg. Here's a look at the side. The back uses the same dinosaur on each package. You can pause this if you can read. Here's the back of the other one. And finally, the left side. These are not current items. I bought them from somebody. As you can see, this package has already been opened. Or rather, there's no tape keeping it shut. I don't know if it had tape when it was first released. Let's open them up and see what's inside the dino eggs. Hey, where are you going? Here we have this one. Let's check it out. Oh yes, I remember that vehicle. We'll set them aside and look at them later. Up next, we have a tractor. And finally, the yellow egg has this vehicle right here. Oh, this one's cool because this one came from a playset. This was not in the regular single Matchbox packages. Since that set didn't have tape, I don't know if those were actually the original models that were sold in it. Somebody could have switched the models, but I doubt if they would because this is one that they would have wanted to keep. These three packages, they're still sealed with tape. So when I open them up, we're going to find out what was in there when they were first in the stores. I am going to open them up and keep them in order to see if we have the same cars and the same colored eggs in each package. <laughs> Okay, let's do the yellow one first. Hey, we got a boat. I wonder if we're going to get a boat. Hey, that's not a boat. The yellow one you can kind of see in there a little bit. I wonder which one we got here. Yep, we got a boat. Next, orange. Hey, we got a boat again, but it's a different kind of boat. We'll put him second. Well, we can put him in front. So we can see. Same one. And last orange. Hmm. Can't really see through it like we could with the yellow ones. Let's see if it's a boat again. Yeah, sure enough. Same one. And lastly, he wants to go firstly since he's been last every time. What do we have? Another water vehicle? Look, we have like a jet ski. I'm gonna take them out of the bags and show you right after these openings. Do we get the same? Does that look like the same? Maybe. Maybe, yes. Same, same, same. And the last one. 
Let's see. Ski. Yep. Well, that was interesting. The yellow one had a school bus instead, but the other ones had the same exact model. Let me get my turntable so we can look at them up close. I call this one a jet ski, but you know what? It's a snowmobile. It should have dawned on me with the, the snowflake on the side. It comes with a blue driver that is not removable. He is stuck on there on the bottom. You can see it has a couple little wheels so you can roll it around. These are not current releases. Remember that the packaging was from like 10 years ago. But sometimes it's nice to open up old stuff to let you see stuff that was around a long time ago or maybe even before you were born. Another watercraft that was in the dino egg was the hydroplane. It's interesting, it doesn't have any graphics at all, but it looks like it was a regular release. Let's see, does it have little wheels? Yep, just like the other one. Let's take a look at all of the sides. I wonder if that big high wing helps keep it down on the water as it's speeding across the lake. Here we have the speedboat. This one actually has a moving part. This little part here in the back spins around. Let's go ahead and spin the whole thing around now. This would be fun to drive on the water. You have a little shady spot. This way you don't have to worry about getting sunburned. Look, it'd be nice and comfortable. And look, it's got wheels just like the other ones. That might not make it authentic like a boat, but remember, it's a toy, and it's something for you to drive around and play with. And the school bus. This one was very unusual to find, mostly because it doesn't have any graphics at all. It's just all yellow. This model was released back then, and I seem to remember it always had graphics on it. Another reason I remember this model is because it has an opening door. If you look underneath, you can see this little device. So all I have to do is push on that, and it, it will open the door. Let me do it slower so you can see. Pretty neat, huh? How that opens the door. This version here, look, it's almost the same yellow color as this one, and it's got graphics. This one was in the regular Matchbox singles. I'm not sure if this one was available in just plain yellow like that, or is it actually a surprise that we found in the eggs? Here we have the 2006 Doom Buggy. I don't have to look at the bottom to see if it has wheels. You can see the wheels real easy. Got big wheels in the back to handle the sand. Little wheels in the front to make sure that it stays down. You don't want to be flipping over. Even if you did flip over, look, it's got a roll cage on top to keep you safe so you don't get crushed by the vehicle as you're racing around in the sand. The tractor shovel was another one found. I like these big wheels. They're just kind of neat. Another cool feature of this, it has a moving part. Well, it should have a moving part, right, if it's a tractor shovel. Let's take a look at all the sides. I'm going to tilt it so you can see that it has graphics on top. Now, let's see what else it has. Hey, it's got a little hook to tow things around. I don't know what you'd be towing around with the tractor, though. Unless it maybe you had a plow that you would pull behind it. Looks like a fun model. Remember I said this one looks like it came from a playset? Yeah, check out Mummy's Gold. It was an older playset. Can you see him in the package? Can you see how he has a cover on the back? Well, when they put him in the egg or the dino egg, look, they didn't include that cover. Now we can see the back real easy. The cover just kind of pops on anyways. It would have been easy to look if you had the playset. I knew it was from a place because I recognized the mommy design on the side. This one has a little tow hook too. It's kind of hard to see, but it's there. Just a little tiny one. It would be nice if they released more hitches. Nowadays in 2015, we don't get a whole lot of uh, trailers or hitches, but there's a lot of models that have that tow hook. I remember seeing these in the stores a long time ago. I thought it was really neat to get something different instead of regular eggs. I don't think I showed you the back. Look, they even have a tail in the back for the dinosaur tail. I think that was really nice design. It would be nice if they offered these again in the future. Thanks for watching. Have fun with your toys. Bye bye.